have a wedding gift for you, and it is my very favorite butt lift. And when I say my favorite, that just means it hurts a whole lot and it really does work. We're gonna use today a resistance band. So if you have this at home, it's a must have. If you don't have it, strap on some ankle weights. You can do it that way. But if you do have this band, this is what you'll need today. Bring it all the way around the backs of your knees. And we're gonna make a nice tight bow. And I do mean a bow, do not make a knot. Impossible to untie. So make a really, really, really nice tight bow here. Yep. Loop, swoop, and pull. Here we go. One, two, three, you got this. Okay. All right. Nice tight bow with that resistance band, as tight as you can go. Once you've made that bow, you're gonna slide it behind your knees all the way to your ankles. So bringing that band to both ankles, now I'm gonna leave it on my left ankle and bring it over my right heel. Honestly, the setup of this is the hardest part, so once you can master that, you'll be good. So I'm on that right heel and the left ankle. We got it. First move, we're bringing down the left elbow all the way down to the mat. So you're really gonna release that upper body. Try not to look up if you can help it. Just keep your head down, I will cue you all the way through. First move you're gonna do, you're gonna tap that right knee down to the mat, very light, squeezing those abs, then pressing that heel all the way back and up. Now straighten that leg out. Do not let that band not let you straighten. Squeeze your abs down, we go. Drop, extend. Drop, extend. So you're turning that knee out slightly, so you're feeling that glute, not the hamstring. All the way down, all the way up, squeezing those abs as you come down. Whew, do I have a good series in store for you today. This is my classic go-to, as I like to call it, booty Botox. I mean, if you're about to put on a bikini for your honeymoon, you are welcome, is all I can say. You will definitely see and feel a difference in your backside after the series. It definitely works. <laughs> I always say it lifts at about two inches. That's what it feels like. Press it back. Okay, now hold it here. Flex that foot, turn off that knee, and pulse. Little baby pulses at the top. Your foot is flexed, your abs are tight, you're relaxing your shoulders. I always kind of move that neck side to side if I feel like my neck's getting too tight here. Press it up. Okay, right here, let's change it up. Knee to the elbow, press all the way through. So you're targeting that knee, sliding up right towards that elbow, feeling that right oblique kind of tighten up as you bring it in. Flexing that foot, heel presses into the wall behind you. Last few. Okay, now we're gonna start to get serious. Now we're gonna get into rounds. So we're gonna mix it up right here. We're gonna bring it hydrant, down, up, press back. Hydrant, down, up, press back. No quitting yet. Hydrant, down, up, press back. Last one slow, then we're gonna bring it up to tempo. Here we go. In, down, up, press back. In, down, up, press back. Okay, feel that booty Botox kicking in? I sure do. This is when you're gonna start to feel that burn for real. Woo. Flex that foot. Last two. Last one. Okay, round two. Hold it back. Pulses up. Little baby pulses. We're not done yet. Keep that leg up there. Do not drop that leg. Now that's not fair. If I have to keep my leg up and your leg went down. Come on, we do this together. Abs tight, relax those shoulders. Little flex pulse. Knee to the elbow. We go. In, press back. In, press back. I'll let you speed it up here. Feeling that energy in that heel. Combination, hydrant, drop, up, back. Hydrant, drop, up, back. Two more slow. Down, up, back. Hydrant, down. Hold it back, up to tempo, here we go. In, drop, up, push back, woo! I'm telling you, I'm here for a good time, not for a long time. These do not take a long time to do, but definitely are effective. Bring it in, down, up, push back. Woo. Last two, last one. Hold it back, baby pulses, this is our last round. Three rounds and then I'll leave you alone. Last round, but we're brides, we really have to push it. This is the time. Press that heel to the back right here. In, press, press. Final push. Count it. Last eight, seven, six, five, for four, three, woo, two. Combo right here. In, down, up, push back. In, 
down, up, push back, stay with me. Don't quit early, it's not fair. As I say, don't cheat on me, I hate being cheated on. Come on, be true to your word. You said we were gonna work out today. Last four, and last three. You got it, last two, last one. Now just hold it back there, hold it. Eight, seven, six, I know, five, four, three, breathe, two, and one, release. Knees together. Sit that right hip to the side. Oh my gosh, I'm in so much pain right now. It's ridiculous. That was horrible. I mean like fully good, but fully horrible. Knees together, feel that stretch. And now on the stabilizing leg, same thing. Still gonna feel it on that stabilizing leg. Always, always. Now for the fun part. The test. Hand on your left butt cheek. And on your right butt cheek. I mean, do you feel that? I can like tangibly feel a difference. Awesome, just awesome. What did that take, like two minutes? Nothing. Let's bring that resistance band to your ankles. The left side, left band is going over your left heel. So now we're on left heel, right ankle. We're gonna tackle this left side, but now you already know what's coming. It's gonna be fun. All right, bring down that elbow. Tighten up that belly button towards that spine. Relax those shoulders. We're gonna tap that knee down to up. Here we go, we go. Tap and press making sure all that energy is flowing through that heel. Now, if you're really good, the harder you press that foot, the more you're gonna feel that actually in your abs. So the more energy you can put in your limbs, the more core strength you'll actually get. Little hack, little dancer hack. So true, that's why we usually put weights on the ends of our arms and legs for everything we do, because it really forces your core to fire a little bit more. Working this with this resistance, so good. Last four, right here, for four. Squeeze those abs, tap that knee down and up. We're just warming it up. Okay, hold it, turn that knee out, little pulse down. Now right here, think about a long line of energy coming all the way from your heel through the crown of your head, elongating the back of your body. So even here, try not to slouch your posture. You wanna lift up and out of that body. Hold it here, last eight. Feeling it already. Okay, starting to heat it up. Next one, we're gonna drive that knee towards the elbow. Take it in, press back. Flexing that foot, you wanna drive that heel into the wall behind you, pressing it back. Last eight, seven, six, five, for four, three, two. Now go slow, right here. We're in, down, up, press back. Hydrant, down, up, back. Hydrant, down, up, back. Stick with me here. Whew. One more. Okay, let's bring that to tempo. Five, six, right here, go. In, down, up, press back. Yep. Okay, this is just our first round, so we're feeling powerful, feeling good, executing this movement flawlessly. Last two. Last one, to your pulses. Pulse it up, baby pulses. Second round, for four, three, two, press that heel straight back. Pressing it out, energy through that heel. Last eight, seven, six, five, keep that knee lifted. Three, two, now go slow, we go. Hydrant, drop, up, press back. Hydrant, drop. A few more slow. Oh, just think about it. Bounce a quarter off this thing, I swear. Some people are gonna be very happy about this. Let's speed it up. Drop, up, push back. Bring it in, drop, up, push back. Keeping those segments nice and tight. We're actually surprisingly close to the home stretch here. Historically, the second side is always easier than the first side. Okay, let's hold it back, little pulses, baby pulses. Okay, do it for the groom. Just do it for the groom. <laughs> They're gonna love it. Keep it going. It's always the highest form of compliment when I get compliments from the spouse of the one I've been training. They're like, hey, their butt looks really good. I'm like, yeah, it does. Press it back. We work hard on that. Oh, finish it up, we're right here. 
eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Take it slow. We go. Hydrant, drop, up, press back. Now do not forget about these abs here. You want to keep these abs super tight. Woo. All right, we're ready for the end. Let's speed it up. We got to go. In, drop, up, push back. In, drop, up, push back. Woo! Feeling it. Rock it out. Four, eight, and seven, and six, and five. Oh, big day's coming. If you have a fitted dress, your booty will love this. Last two. Last one. And hold it up, hold it. Just hold. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Drop that knee down, knees together. Go ahead, sit that hip to the side, stretch out that abductor. <sighs> okay. I mean, if that doesn't feel like a whole new butt cheek to you, uh, it's like. Amazing. It doesn't matter how conditioned you are. I find that these exercises always work every single day. All right. Give the test. Left side, right side. Oh, yeah. Now we're feeling more even. Well, your wedding gift is complete. <laughs> Not going to make you do any more of those today. Take a little stretch. Make sure the butt are, butts are released. Um, I could barely talk. That was so hard. All right. I love you guys. Uh, have a great rest of your day, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye.